Kansas State opened the 95 campaign with high expectations. And the Purple certainly didn't disappoint in front of 35,000 Purple fans at KSU Stadium. First and 10, Kansas State has the ball at the Temple 15, 17-7 Cats. Back to throw Miller, fade route near side, looking for Lockett at the goal line. Acrobatic catch, touchdown near the deep left pylon. Lockett does it again. The Wildcat defense was dominant throughout, holding Temple to just 49 yards rushing and 270 yards in total offense. Kansas State rolled over Temple 34-7, its sixth straight season opening victory. Third down and seven. Football at the 28 of Cincinnati out of the shotgun. Miller, here comes the blitz once again. Miller is throwing for the end zone, looking for Lockett. Lockett and makes a diving catch. Touchdown, Kevin Lockett. Five yards deep in the end zone. He burns your main tread. Kansas State takes the lead for the first time tonight. But as long as there was time on the clock, Kansas State had a chance. And Matt Miller skillfully engineered a drive that will long be remembered in Wildcat land. To the left side, he is pumping. He is pumping, now holding. He's going to run the football. He's at the 45, gets out of bounds to stop the clock at the 47. He gains six yards, 29 seconds left in the game. Two receivers left, again, one to the right. Out of the shotgun, Cincinnati back in a prevent defense. Miller setting up, throwing a pass, caught by Schweiger at the 40-yard line, trying to get outside, and he is... Out of bounds to stop the clock at the Cincinnati 31 and only eight seconds remain in the game. First down and 10 for Kansas State at the Cincinnati 31 and a half. Six DBs in there for Cincinnati. Back to throw Miller. Quick pass to the right side, running out of bounds at the 21. Three seconds left to go in the game. Finally, the ball game would come down to the last play from scrimmage and the combination of Miller to Lockett. Lockett lines up to the right side. Miller will take the shotgun snap from Jason Johnson. He's back to throw. They roll left. Miller throwing for the end zone. He's looking for Lockett, who makes the catch. Touchdown, K-State on the final play of the game. Kevin Lockett from Matt Miller on the last play of the game. Are you kidding me? Kansas State on the last play of the game finds Kevin Lockett at the right pylon. Kansas State had survived and snatched victory from certain defeat and recorded a 23-21 victory over Cincinnati to move 2-0 on the season. Three saw Kansas State open a three-game homestand that would be one of the most dominant in college football history. The Wildcats opened the homestand against appropriately the Zips of Akron. Matt Miller sprint out to the right side, turns back left, guns it long, looking for Lockett, he's got it, and is inside the pylon touchdown, Kansas State. K-State still with four DBs in the game. Back to throw, here comes the pass rush. McEwen chasing Junko, throws intercepted. Canny, he's at the 10-yard line up the right side, line five, touchdown. Chris Canny, his third interception of the evening. This time it's for a touchdown. When it was over, the Kansas State offense had set a school total offensive record with 590 total yards. And K-State had scored the most points since a Cat football team in 1909. The defense was even more dominant as Kansas State improved to 3-0 on the year with a 67-to-zip whipping of the zips of Akron. The Kansas State offense kicked in full gear in the second 30 minutes after scoring just one touchdown in the first half. And even though the Wildcat offense piled up more than 500 yards of total offense for the second straight week, the story in this game was the outstanding defense that harassed the Huskies all afternoon. There was no safe place for the Husky. They line up a receiver left in motion. Ralph Strickland from a wing to the right side to the left side. They're going to come on a fake reverse to Strickland to throw Gilbert out of his own end zone. He's hit and the ball's loose in the end zone. Scramble for the loose ball. K-State trying to get it. So are the Husky safety. K-State trying to spread the field. There is movement on the line of scrimmage. There's a fade right near side. Lock and he makes the catch. Touchdown. When it was all said and done, Kansas State had win number four and its second straight shutout with a 44-0 dogging of the Northern Illinois Huskies.